Hello. So till now we have been dealing with uh, reflection in most cases, and the thing is we aren't really changing our medium. Now in this video and the upcoming videos, we will take one step further and see what happens if we change our medium. So we have two media here. How does light behave? So let us see through an example. So here is the apparatus. I have a jar. It has some air in this this a little smoke in it from agarbatti and some water and this water has some milk in it milk colloids and i have a laser the previous one now if i turn off the light and incident this laser light okay on in, in the beaker such that it goes through there and comes in the water you see how it's bending hmm? well light is traveling in straight line and then it's bending okay and how it is bending it if it went straight it would end up somewhere somewhere over there but it's clearly not the case it's ending up somewhere over there so this phenomena of bending okay is known as refraction you can clearly see oops yeah light is bending so how will it work when we you know change the angle so and notice this carefully that's how it will bend at very large angles by large i mean taking the angle from the normal and that's how it will look in a smaller angle again from the normal what does this tell us about light why does light bend so we'll answer all these questions so as a diagram to our experiment this is our angle of incidence so if we this is a point okay and we draw normal again a normal is a line perpendicular to the plane and we measure this one this angle this is called the angle of incidence okay and this one if we measure the refracted ray this is called the refracted ray and this angle is known as the angle of refraction so that's it for that's it for this video that's it for today in the next video we'll answer some questions and do some mathematics regarding this phenomena called refraction